So today, today is like a big, big, big event that is happening at work. And my insecurity about my hair is kicking in. I kind of like, I completely forgot about this event was this week. And I put my hair on twist last weekend. Let me tell you, I was have, just having a panic attack. Um, and then I wanted, at some point last night, I wanted to unbraid it, have like a twist out. And I remember I made a promise I am going to wear this twist for six weeks. So <laughs> I am going to style it. You guys can get ready with me while I um, deal with that. So if you are in corporate, these things can happen. There's not much people like my hair that's half the type of my hair in the office. Well, not saying that not much. There's nobody else in my team that have uh, my type of hair. Intimidated and um, can question yourself. Sometimes get really uncomfortable. I'm going to make it work. And I'm gonna take you guys with me and keep you updated how I feel about it. But yeah, it's a big, big event where all the um, all the state representative will be there. And um, yeah, so the pressure is real. <laughs> as that um, let's do my facial with me I think today I'm gonna wear a little bit of makeup this is me being very honest here I am a little bit unsecure about the whole thing because I feel like I should have my hair in a twist out or um, a wash and go um, so I am going to we're gonna go this do this together hopefully I don't feel too uncomfortable I am able to to go go in do my thing and then get back dealing with your natural hair and corporate wear um, you being uh, you've been told you know our hair is not pretty enough it's not professional the way we wear our hair so sometimes we feel like uncomfortable and this is what I'm feeling today uh, because of all this comment all this stuff that we grow up to hear about our hair all this negative thing that we hear about our hair and I go with my I will definitely after the event just come back to tell you guys like how it was, how I feel, but right now, that's how I feel. It's my hair. It's, I should be this one. We had a big meeting about this event yesterday. I think it's gonna be like 300 people. And to be honest, I'm kind of nervous. And we are the hosts, so we are doing this event for the state. It is nerve wracking and I'll be in the middle of over 300 people. And being the host mean in my job at this event is to talk to the guests and you know, as they go into their seat, bringing them to their seat. Like I said, I don't really wear makeup, but today I feel like I need it. 
I need something. So we're gonna go with lullaby. Okay. I have this. I I think it's like I don't know, maybe like four or five years old. One day I'm gonna go to the mall or something and get some makeup just to have it. And occasions like this when I'm like stressed out uh, because I don't think this is enough. because I think I get this that was before COVID um, I used to work for a place where we used to have like a, a map store and then they gave us these actually didn't pay for that um, that was a free free Mac I don't know SP15 something um, so I don't know but that was like before COVID because the store was closed right after like when COVID hit that store was at the airport and then we closed it so that was like way before COVID so I don't know I don't know if makeup expired you guys tell me let me know if makeup expired or something let's start I've seen people put like I don't know what this is called. They also they also have this right here. Good. Should try to find some earrings to to wear. But anyway, this is the final look. I don't know if you guys can see me. Um, looking good, but yeah. And 
We'll see how I feel later um, after the event. So I'll come back and let you guys know. So, work day is complete. Um, and the event went really well with a lot of people. It was really nice to do a lot of like official um, but the fact that it is 2024 and I still have to worry about uh, society about how my hair, my natural hair, um, it's, it's a problem. Um, I shouldn't have to, to worry about that. Let me tell you, last night, I just like had like a, almost like a panic attack. Anxiety was speaking in because I wasn't sure how professionally my um, this was gonna, my hair, was gonna look because I simply have my natural hair on some twist and yeah but I made it through um somebody just called me by somebody else's name because he was the other person of my race that was in here and then because that person have uh, some like some type of like locks in her hair and apparently we all deserve it. Anyway, if you are um if you work in corporate and you wear your hair naturally um so stuff like that might happen you might have um anxiety about you know the way your hair look because it look natural it doesn't look straight as you know your co-workers um know that it is okay to feel that way and um there's nothing you can do about that but wear your hair the way it was grown out of your scalp if you choose to do that um We cannot change the way we look. We cannot change our hair. This is how it come out of our scalp. And if we are like having to think about all that, it's because we are like an office. We are worried about what other people are gonna say. Our eye hairs are professional enough. That's to tell you there is a lot of work that should be done in our community. I hope it's one day that I going to work and wearing my hair like this doesn't give me anxiety but that's how I was feeling today but it was good it was a success but yeah just to tell you just do you do your hair the way you want wear your natural hair and um, yeah that's it, it guys just uh, embrace your natural hair Embrace your natural hair while you work in corporate. Embrace it. This is yours. It's your hair is beautiful. Um, yeah, thank you for watching. Thank you for being here. Please take care of yourself. Take care of your hair. And take care of your family. I will see you in the next video. Bye.